Let's talk about changes to the thermo final exam. This is a grove of bamboo next to my house. In addition to being a bit of an invasive species, it's also always a little bit cooler over here. How does the work I do with this bike pump relate to the pressure change in my tire? Is this gas-powered engine a better or worse use of the world's energy than this battery-powered blower? No one worries about this bursting into flames, but silos full of flour can explode. What's up with that? What happens when a kernel turns into a piece of popped corn? And why does it take so much energy? It's questions like this that I want you to ask and then answer and then extend in your thermodynamics final exam, which is now your thermodynamics portfolio. I want you to find one problem that illustrates each of the three big ideas from the class. That is three different situations. Identify a thermodynamic situation related to one of those goals. Scribe it using appropriate thermodynamic models, assumptions, and mathematical descriptions. Solve the problem and share. What's next? How can we extend this? And you're welcome to document and share your work any way that makes sense to you and works for the problem. You can do it through video, you can do it through a presentation, you can do it through good old fashioned text on paper. This really is a bit of an invitation to think like I do. To wander around and say, oh look, here's some thermodynamics. I wonder what I can do with that. Your family will probably enjoy this just as much as mine does. I hope you'll agree that this is a much better way for you to show mastery of the class material than to do a sit down exam. I'm really looking forward to see what you come up with.